This video was made possible by EA Game Changers. <laughs> Welcome back to Joy's Creative Finger and a special thanks to EA Fire Monkeys for providing me with early access to the latest update. We are touring the Desert Oasis live event grand prize. The actual update goes live on the 9th of March at 9 p.m. subject to change and the event itself runs from the 10th to the 23rd of March. Now it's a driveway home and so it's a different plot on a driveway home and it's free for the first buy but the second buy would cost simoleons and I don't know the exact price. It depends on your town value. Here is the grand prize. It's on a desert plot, but it's a driveway plot. So you can see you can unlock more cars if you want to. And of course, it's desert themed. You can see you've got boulders, some tumbleweed, cactus and so on dotted around on the even surfaces. And yeah, the entire terrain just looks exactly like what you would find on a desert uh, patch of land, as it were. Okay, I've never been to the desert. <laughs> so I wouldn't know. <laughs> I have an idea from pictures. But it's got a large balcony here with the items that you can expect to unlock in the Desert Oasis live event. The chairs, the railing, the patio paving, down and up. And then you've got this beautiful exterior to the build. You've got a very large pool at the back here and more of the chairs. And when I see that number of chairs, I'm thinking, why do we only have 10 Sims on a plot? We should have loads of Sims on a plot to match those amount of chairs. <laughs> okay, this is the other side of the building and we're back around to the front. So we're quickly going to have a look inside and we will take a look at what the build looks like on a smaller plot right so you come through the distressed doors that you unlock in the event that's the double one and straight ahead you have a single one it's an entrance hall you've got the rugs the macrame wall hangings and windows as well and you come straight through to a big room nothing here is new but for the artwork and the macrame uh, walnut windows the rug the plant and let's just close that and then you come under the arch, which of course is a favorite part for me. And you have a large living room. Uh, you've got the stairs in the corner here, a bookshelf and a white macrame wall hanging, the fireplace, the rugs, the plants, the stool. <laughs> and this is a double height room, as you can see here. So that would be the complete living space. And then you walk straight through under another arch to the kitchen, mix and match of furniture around. A bathroom on the side the flooring looks new I haven't seen that in my game certainly not but that's a full bathroom then you've got a kitchen I've always wondered about bathrooms next to kitchens it's weird but yeah this is the kitchen area I wish we had cabinets so units with and without and then you've got a dining space here at the end with the walnut options and the rug and then underneath right here it's actually underneath a um, patio or balcony <laughs> you got more seating okay let's quickly go upstairs that staircase is patterned as you can see that's the walnut option there is also a just ash wired I think it is so let's get Mallory here and there is a little balcony in the house <laughs> right across there in the mezzanine space out to this balcony outside Okay, ton of chairs everywhere, as you can see. We need more sims to fill up these chairs. Right, there is a little arch here that leads into some living spaces. So if I drop the walls, you can see that there are some items in there. And then three doors, so three different spaces. Okay, now there is also a door to the room on this side and a door into the little alcove we just looked at. Two ways into the bedroom, that's fun. And um, yeah, you could see that she could come out through there as well. This room has three doors, <laughs> same beddings. And um, this is the other door that leads out to a personal balcony, just to stand out and look at the desert. Okay, the bathroom is the middle door in that little alcove. Uh, and that's what we have here in this space. Nice old furniture. And then further in here is where we have another bedroom with the same beds and, and stuff like that. Okay, now in the Sim Chase, I think uh, 11 or 12, or 12 or 13, uh, there are going to be some lovely beds. So look out for that. That go with a desert theme, all right? 
Okay, so there you have it. That's the entire plot. And um, we're going to very quickly look at the plot on, well, the house on a small plot, so you can see. And I would assume at a glance that it's exactly the same house without the pool. So just take the pool off and you've got the house situated in place. Um, but assumptions are a tricky thing. So we've seen what it looks like on the outside. We're just going to quickly read through and ensure that everything is where it should be and everything is in there as you would have expected, assuming you didn't unlock bigger plots. So everything looks the same to me. If not, leave a comment if I missed it. <laughs> Well, thank you so much for watching and don't forget to look in the description down below for links to other videos associated with this update and you can also go and watch the early access latest update playlist to see all videos in one go and you won't miss anything don't forget to subscribe too if you want to and join our facebook group to see floor plans for some of the bills that i have used to showcase some of the items in this update Thank you so very much for watching and I will see you again soon in the next video. Bye.